What are the common causes of static electricity in the human body? Hello everyone, and welcome to our intriguing exploration of static electricity in the human body. This phenomenon, though occasionally startling, is a fascinating aspect of everyday physics at work. Today, we will delve into the common causes that lead to those surprising sparks. Static electricity is an imbalance of electric charges within or on the surface of a material, and it often shows up in our lives in quite surprising ways. What is static electricity? To understand what causes static electricity in the human body, it's essential to comprehend what it is. Static electricity is the result of an imbalance between negative and positive charges in an object. These charges can build up on the surface of an object until they find a way to be released or discharged. The rubbing of certain materials against one another can transfer negative charges, or electrons. This transfer of electrons creates an imbalance, which we often experience as a shock or spark of static electricity. How does the human body generate static electricity? In the human body, static electricity typically accumulates when we rub against certain materials, often those that are insulators of electricity. These materials can include rubber, certain types of plastic, and even dry, airless environments. Let's break down some of these common scenarios. 1. Clothing. Static electricity often builds up in our bodies when our clothes rub against our skin. This is particularly common in dry conditions and with certain types of fabric like wool or synthetic materials. 2. Footwear and flooring. Walking on carpet with rubber-soled shoes is a notorious cause of static electricity. As your shoes rub against the carpet, they pick up extra electrons. These are then transferred to you, leading to an excess of electrons and a negatively charged body. 3. Low humidity environments. Dry, airless environments enhance the buildup of static electricity. That's why you may notice more static shocks during winter when the air is dry both outdoors and indoors due to heating systems. 4. Human hair. Just like with clothing, certain types of hair are more prone to static electricity. Dry, damaged or chemically treated hair tends to accumulate static charge more easily than healthy, moisturized hair. How to prevent static electricity? Though static electricity is a natural occurrence and usually harmless, it can be annoying. To prevent it, you can take steps like moisturizing your skin, using a humidifier to increase the moisture level in the air, wearing clothes made of natural fibers, or using anti-static sprays on your clothing and furniture. In conclusion, static electricity in the human body is a fascinating phenomenon that we encounter on a regular basis. It's a testament to the intricate dance of physics that plays out in our everyday lives. While it can be surprising and occasionally irritating, it's a harmless occurrence that serves as a reminder of our constant interaction with the world around us. So next time you experience a spark or shock, remember, it's simply static electricity at work, 